Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. I actually owed you guys this one. I had some of you comment in my previous couch review video that you wanted to know if we still liked our couch. You know, kind of a update since we got it. It's been seven months since we received our couch from our house. It, we got it back in May. As you can tell, I am heavily pregnant right now. I am almost in my ninth month of pregnancy, so that means that this baby can come pretty soon. Um, so I just wanted to film this for you guys, just in case the baby arrives and then things get more complicated, you know? By the way, this is not a sponsored video. This is my honest review. I just wanted to share with you guys because that video actually got a lot of attention and a lot of comments. And I know a lot of you guys went on the website to look for it and it was already sold out. This is the Norwood sectional in merino cotton, which is the lighter version. The other one is like a dark gray. I am not sure if they have restocked it. If they have, I'll link it down below. But if they don't have it, then you can check their other options um, because your quality is actually really good. I wrote down some of some notes earlier because I didn't want to forget anything. And the first thing I want to mention is that the material has been really easy to clean. We haven't had any major accidents yet, um, but I did spill some marinara sauce just a tiny bit pretty soon after we got it. I know I said we weren't going to eat sitting on the couch but like realistically we have the tv in front of the couch and sometimes you know you just want to have dinner and watch a good show or something so i spilled some marinara sauce um and i was kind of freaking out because i'm like oh my god how am i gonna take this out honestly i just took a little bit of bounty um i'm not even sure if i put any product on it maybe just water and it came right off so this is a performance fabric it's the, the standard one. We didn't do any upgrades or anything like that. It's the standard fabric, but it is a performance fabric. And it was super easy to clean and there's no stain on it. So that was great. That's the first thing I wanted to mention because I was very impressed by that. I didn't even spray it with anything to protect it. I've seen in other videos that some people spray it with, I can't remember the name of the product, but um, something to protect the fabric and we didn't have to do that. So that's a good thing we've also found that it's amazing to entertain obviously it is a big couch the couch that we had before was super tiny like only three people could sit on it and we've had a lot of people over um, especially the weekend of our baby shower we've had friends over and it just changes the vibe in that in our apartment because before it was kind of awkward some people would sit on the sofa we had and some other people had to sit on our counter stools and it would just it would break the atmosphere this time we had family and friends come over and everybody sat here and it became like a sharing space and a hangout space so that's something positive about getting a big sectional like that if you like to entertain we've also had people sleep over and sleep on this couch um the first time somebody slept on this couch was actually like recent like right after we purchased it we had one of our friends come over and sleep on the couch and he said that it was amazing that he had a great night's sleep and then for our baby shower we had family come over and they also slept on the couch we had actually two people sleep on the couch at the same time because one person can sleep on this side and the other person on this side and you still have a lot of space so that's convenient since we don't have a guest bedroom or a guest bed our couch can double you know it's like our little hotel area another thing that we like is the fact that it maintains its shape so even when people like my concern was that people sleeping on it would make it sink or something like that but that didn't happen like it's as bouncy as it was before it's not sunken or anything like that so that's another positive thing. So I'm mentioning all the things that we love so far about the couch. But I'm also going to mention the things that we're not that crazy about. And it's not necessarily any negative stuff. It's just something to keep in mind. Um, for example, this couch is firm. It's comfortable, but it's firm. So it's I don't think you can really compare it to like 
a cloud couch where you sink in and it's all mushy and soft this is not it so it's not uncomfortable either it's very comfortable but i thought that maybe a few months later the couch would get softer but it doesn't that's not a bad thing i mean it depends on what you want we wanted a couch that would last at least i don't know like the next 10 years even when we move into a house or a bigger space so the fact that it doesn't sink in and becomes all mushy is actually a positive thing for us but keep in mind if you're looking for something like the cloud couch or something that feels very loungy this is not it although i love to lounge on this couch but it's not super soft that's what i mean something to keep in mind is that this couch is very deep meaning that when you sit all the way back like this in order for your back to be hitting the back of the couch sometimes your feet are like really far away from the floor um and i found myself putting another one of the other cushions in front of the other so i can have more support now i know what you're thinking just get throw pillows because <laughs> that is clearly the reasonable thing to do for some reason the times that we've been to the store we haven't found throw pillows that we absolutely love so that's something on our to-do list so for now we just put one cushion in front of the other and <laughs> you know especially now that i'm pregnant i don't want to be like all the way back on the couch because you know this baby is putting so much pressure on my lungs and that's why i sound like i'm out of breath right now but yes maybe some throw pillows would be a good idea um it's nice i mean it's nice to have a deep couch it's, you know to watch tv and stuff like that but i would recommend getting throw pillows and eventually we will i'm sorry if the lighting is changing throughout the video but it's currently 3 24 p.m and the sun is already going away <laughs> the sun is already setting because it's december in new jersey and last night it actually snowed a little bit um so yeah it's been really dark and gloomy so i'm just trying to get through this video before the sun decides to completely abandon us one other thing that i wanted to mention but it's totally not a big deal is that some of the feathers from the filling have come out but i'm talking about less than 10 in the last seven months um this couch is filled with a mixture of feathers and some other material i'm not sure if it's like foam or something like that but it's half and half and i i, I mean i didn't even think about the fact that it was filled with feathers in the beginning like one day i just saw one come out and i was like oh interesting and then i realized that it was part of the filling but it hasn't been anything crazy when i was doing my initial research and looking at different companies and different brands i saw that a lot of the other couches i think it was one from uh ashley furniture where people were com like people were complaining that all the feathers were coming out all the time and it was a mess with this one occasionally you'll see one feather that comes out or something like that but it's totally not a big deal like it's nothing alarming or anything or nothing that would change the structure of the couch something else to keep in mind is that this material because it's like a performance fabric and it's also very thick can get hot during the summer so when we got it it was may so right before summer i've used this couch a lot because um we received it the same day that i found out i was pregnant <laughs> so imagine like first trimester i was kind of nauseous and tired and this corner became my per my permanent space in this apartment um i watch a lot of tv i was lounging here a lot so during those months of like june july it was kind of hot i would suggest um you can put a blanket on it or something like that and that way it creates you know some space between your skin and this material that's one of the things to keep in mind but it's nothing that would like it's nothing that made me regret getting this fabric at all um now that it's winter it's actually nice so but i just wanted to mention it in case you're looking for a different material that's softer maybe like linen or something like that the only thing is like linen I don't think is a performance fabric like this one so especially now that we're gonna have kids 
were thinking about like you know things spilling or like their little dirty hands when you know when they're walking around and stuff like that so i actually like um the decision that we made well guys i was trying to think for a while if there was anything else i wanted to mention the baby has hiccups right now <laughs> she's like jumping right now if you guys have any questions please leave them down below this couch is from our house and i actually have their catalog that they sent for it says 2022 style issue and it has like all the all their pieces and all their items and everything is like nice quality and luxurious um again this is not sponsored but if anybody from our house is watching this video please sponsor me i would love to work with you guys because i am a happy customer don't forget to hit the like button and also subscribe anytime you hit the like button the algorithm knows that you enjoyed it and then it shows it to other people i have been working so hard on growing my channel as you can tell my subscribers have been going up and i am so close to hitting a thousand subscribers and that has been my goal for the year so before the year ends go ahead and hit that subscribe button and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching bye guys